Hey guys, thank you so much for joining me again today. Today we are going to be checking out The Martian from 2015. I'm excited about this one. I love a good sci-fi. I know it has Matt Damon in it, but I really don't know what it's about. So I'm very excited to get into it and see what it's all about. So let's get to it. Here we go. The Martian. I'm excited. I watched The Born Identity recently. I'm a big Matt Damon fan, so yay. All right, we're in space. I love it. I love space movies. They're always good for me. The Martian. Going to Mars, I assume. NASA, NASA landing site. Much finer, and this should be ideal for chem analysis. Mark just discovered dirt. What are you doing? Uh, making sure the MAV is still We got a team on Mars, I think. Uh oh, like a master yeah, alarm. You never want to hear that. I saw that in this morning's briefing. The storm's gonna be a lot worse. Oh no. Are they gonna see it in the distance? Please don't see it in the distance. Martinez, how's it look? Oh boy, go inside. Here's in diameter bearing force of 8,600 newtons. Anything more than that, and the map can tip. Begin abort procedure. Yeah, they have to abort. Let's wait it out. Prep emergency departure. That's an order. Yeah, they're way over whatever the limit was for abort, right? Long before takeoff. 12 minutes. Ready? Ready! <gasps> okay! What? Is that outside? No. Oh my god. 10 degrees and the map is gonna tip at 12.3. We might be able to keep the map from tipping. How? Oh no! Suit breach detected. Suit breach. Oh no. How long can he survive decompression? Less than a minute. Oh my god. Go! If it takes you gone. Can you hear me? She's grasping for anything. I don't even know what to say. This is bananas right off the bat. Mark is dead. What the hell is wrong with you? Oh, he's right. Come on, come on. What's she gonna see? Something weird gonna pop out? She's in? Let's go, let's go. Go, 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 go. Ready to launch. Come go. Launch. Damn. They lost a guy. <gasps> I have chills. Astronaut Mark Watton was killed. Mark Man. Watton is well, dead. If they stayed, it would have been a lot worse, though. Does that really happen on Mars? Those kind of storms? If so, how are we ever going to go there, really? Oh, is he still alive? <gasps> Critical. Oh, he's still alive. He's all by himself. Is he injured? Is there something sticking out of him? Oh, he's like punctured. How is he still alive? Yikes. Can he get in touch with anyone? That'd be so brutal, just to realize you're all alone. At least he has, like, a habitat still. Pressure stable. But for how long? Yeah, not good. Uh, he's gonna have to do, fix his own wound. Oh, is that, like, uh, to numb it? I don't know. Space medicine. Oh, it's doing friggin' surgery on himself. Ugh. Oh. Well, he got it out. Good job. Staples. Ah. Oh, he looks rough. Yeah. Mark Watney, I'm alive. He's alive and all alone. I'm guessing that's gonna come as a surprise to mm. the entire world, really. Surprise. <laughs> this length of our primary communications antenna ripped a hole in me, but the, the antenna managed to seal the breach in my suit. I have no way to contact NASA. It's gonna be four years until a manned mission can reach oh, me. And I'm gonna have designed to last 31 days. Um, this is not good. 31 days? I'm gonna run out of food. Yeah. Yeah, not good. Bad. All, all around. Oh. So eerie to be there all by yourself. Yeah, maybe some of the other crew members have something that can be useful. I'm not gonna die. Oh no? Alright. 
Soul 21. All good plans begin with breakfast. Two, four, sweet and sour chicken. Do not open until Thanksgiving. Let's do the math. Yeah, let's do some math. 68 souls worth of food, that's for six. So okay. for just me, I figure I can stretch to 400 if I ration. I gotta figure out a way to grow on okay. a planet where nothing grows. There's no Luckily, soil. I'm a botanist. Oh. Mars fever. My botany powers. <laughs> Science. All right, human waste. Making some. At least he has a project. Otherwise, you might just go friggin' nuts in isolation there. Ration! Ugh, oh, you Mars. <laughs> he is very cool. Yo, handsome. Jesus. Is that the waste from everyone? Oh, boy. Well, I mean, he's a botanist. I think it'll work. Oh, 36. That's a cool way to say day. The problem is water. 126 mm. square meters of soil. Every yeah. 240 liters of water. And right. Unused hydrazines and over an iridium catalyst. And then if I just direct the hydrogen and burn it, nothing bad has ever happened from lighting hydrogen on fire. <laughs> well. So everything's flame retardant, with the exception of Martinez's personal items. Uh -huh. you didn't want me to go through your stuff. You shouldn't have left me on a desolate planet. Very fair. I'm wondering how accurate the science is in this. Is this based on a book, like written by a scientist? This is fascinating. <gasps> Dude. Oh, he blew himself up. Oh, I blew myself up. <laughs> right. The excess oxygen that I've been exhaling because I'm stupid. <laughs> Let's hope he doesn't blow himself up again. <laughs> How the Jet Propulsion Lab was founded. Five guys at Caltech. They nearly burned down their dorm. Huh? And now we have a space program. Yeah, he's like, um. <laughs> nice. Does he have a sprout? He has a sprout! Hey there. Cute. The men and women of NASA. He's alive! They honor the legacy. Mark's leaving his sacrifice will not be in vain. Do any of his space buddies have a hunch that he might still be alive or anything? Probably not. I need you to authorize my satellite time. To spare a few hours. Not about the satellite time. Oh, are they going to fly over and see what they have left? The second we point the satellites at the hab, Mark oh, yeah, 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 yeah. to the world. Congress won't reimburse us if I put a dead astronaut on the front page of the Meteorology estimates that he'll be covered in sand within a year. Okay. Crap. Okay, consider this. <clears throat> Aries 6... To bring his body home. More that is smart. We wait a year, nobody gives a He's right. He's right about that. I don't know what's gonna happen here. Like, anything could happen. Is it the habitat? Yeah, 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 yeah. Enhance, zoom, enhance. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, good, 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 good. Security? Uh, somebody's moving the rover around. How sure? Wow. 100%. Watney is really alive. We don't want the Ares 3 crew to know. Why? They have another 10 months on their trip. They need to be alert and undisturbed. Uh, They'd be devastated to find out they left him there alive. How are we going to handle the public? Legally, we have 24 hours to release these pictures. But he's going to starve to death long before we can help him. That is what it would seem like. You can imagine what he's going through up there. 50 million miles away from home. Yeah. What the hell is he thinking right now? It's just chilling. I'm definitely going to die if I have to listen <laughs> to any more. My God, Commander Lewis. I'm not going to turn the beat around. I refuse. <laughs> Sol 70. The next NASA mission is Ares 4, 3,200 kilometers away. Oof, that's far. In four years, I'll have to be there. Yeah. I've got one working rover, 35 kilometers, before the battery has to be recharged. This journey is going to take 50 days. 50 days? Inside a rover with marginal life support. What up? There's another storm. I'm going to have to science the sh <laughs> He's awesome in this. I love him. Just science the shit out of it. Amazing. Oh, it's so cold. I have doubled my battery life, but if I use the heater, I will burn through half my battery. If I do not, you I will, will die. Be slowly killed. My balls are frozen. <laughs> I'm calling it, I'm calling it. Too cold. Too cold. Too cold. I may have a solution. Digging up the radioisotope thermoelectric generator. One of the lessons Ooh. was don't dig up the big box of plutonium. If they rupture, no more humans. 
Which is why we buried it. As long as I don't break it. Please don't <laughs> drop Everything it. Everything will be fine out loud. Right now, I have bigger <laughs> problems. Commander Lewis's personal drive. Oh, he's into it. Yes. I am loving Matt Damon in this. God, I hope he doesn't die. Bruce, what's the earliest we can get a pre-supply there? It'll take nine months. Three months. That's... You're going to say it's impossible, and then I'm going to make a speech. Say uh, something no. like the overtime alone will be a nightmare. It will be a nightmare. We need to tell the crew. They deserve to know. Yeah, they do. They're going to find out. Once there's a real rescue plan, we'll tell no. them. Bruce says three months. We'll do our best. Mark dies if you don't. It's been 48 souls since Ooh, I planted the potatoes. Looking they grew good. Even than I expected. 400 healthy potato plants. The smaller wow. ones all reseed. The Martian grown potatoes. Not bad. Figured something out. I know what I'm gonna do. Perfect. I have total faith in him and his science. I hope he doesn't die though. Where the hell is he going? All by himself. There's nothing out there except the. What? Yeah, the what? It... I need a map. Show me a map. Yeah. Love a good map. Hey, where's Watney? Hey. I know where he's going. Jet Propulsion Lab in Pasadena. This is very curious. What the heck is that? It's a parachute. What are the chances Mark can get it working? Oh. Oh my god, what is it? That's fine. Pathfinder. Interesting. Ah. Soul 109. I wonder what he's hoping to get out of this. There we go. Holy sh Is he making contact? No way. Oh, signal apart. <laughs> Is it to make contact? Is that right? Are you deceiving me? Yes. No. Nice, 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 nice. Huh. Yes. Nailed it. We have to have complex astrophysical engineering conversations. Luckily, okay, the this camera is good. does spin. So I can make an alphabet. Hexadecimal. That's a make a language. This is the coolest. I figured one of you guys kept an ASCII table. Super nerd, Beth Johansson. Who <laughs> also had leather goddesses of Phobos on her personal laptop. <laughs> this is so cool. I know where he's going with this. Where? This is so cool. <laughs> I love this. I have chills just from the science. This is gonna take a long time. How will I? Wake up. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm pale by antenna. Crew had reason to think me dead. Not their fault. Aw, he's nice. People at NASA have sent me how to hack the rover nice. so that it can talk. NASA can link the rover and we're in business. Amazing. Oh, please work. I don't want to jinx it, but it kind of feels like everything's going too smoothly. The whole world is rooting for you. We're putting together a supply mission until Ares 4. Oh, yeah. Man, that must be so much relief. Really looking forward to not dying. <laughs> right. <laughs> At least his sense of humor is intact. What did they say when they found out? Mm -hmm. We never told them because we're shady. We haven't told the crew. We need them to concentrate. Yeah, that's garbage. F-word, <laughs> word in German form. <laughs> Watch your language. Everything is being broadcast. Perfect. Yeah? What's he gonna say? Oh my God. He's under a tremendous amount of stress. <laughs> I can only imagine. Thank you, Mr. President. The longer we wait, the worse it's going to get. Mm -hmm. It's time, Teddy. Four months. They're going to be pissed. Oh, there's a video message? Here we go. Mitch Henderson, Mark Watney is still alive. Oh, my God. Uh, we found out two months ago. And two months. Oh, my God. It's not your fault. Mark stresses that. Take some time to absorb. I mean, this is good news, but... They're gonna want to go back and get him, but they're too far away now. You were following orders. I left him behind. You didn't know. Now that NASA can talk to me, they won't shut up. Trying to <laughs> micromanage my crops. I am the greatest botanist on this planet. <laughs> oh, one big bonus is the email. I'm getting them again. The coolest one, though, from University of Chicago, my alma mater. Once you grow crops, you've officially colonized it. 
I colonized Mars. Nice. In your face, Neil Armstrong. <laughs> Other news, there's been a request for me to, for a photograph. He's too cute. I'm just really worried that he's gonna die at the end. You hardly <laughs> what, he's the Fonz? <laughs> Just yes. be grateful. Rose, your team's still on schedule? <laughs> we'll make it. What's the probe to Mars on Sol 868? Damn. 112 Sols worth of food. We get there on 868, assuming nothing goes wrong. I know. I don't like this guy right now, but I have a feeling it's not all gonna go according to plan. Exactly! <gasps> no! No, 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 no. Suit breach detected. He's got a hole in his shield. His helmet. Oxygen level 10%. Oh my god. I knew it. I knew something bad was gonna happen. Suit pressure. Stay Craig, what's left of it? Is it everything? Is it all those potatoes and everything? No. Crap. Does he have time to start over? Can he even? Stable. This is so bad. God, Don't freak God. out. Oh no. All this hard work. How long does he have? So with potatoes, 609. We're gonna have to launch as soon as possible. We need 13 days to amount the boosters gives Bruce. 47 days to make this break. I don't know. Okay. <laughs> bad I'm news, guys. Change of clothes. What about the crew there? What if they went back? NASA's letting us talk to you. And I Drew the short straw. Sorry, we left you behind. Just <laughs> don't like you. It's a lot roomier. That's have so to take cute. Doing your That's tasks. what he means. It's only botany. It's not real science. <laughs> oh, I have chills everywhere. Every day I go out and look at the vast horizons just because I can. They should turn around. Can't they get there faster? I guess they're on like a different mission and. It's just for one guy. I don't know. I mean, he can't repressurize really that, can he? Will it work? Pressure stable. What's he thinking? He's a man of ideas. He'll think of something. Rich. <laughs> can't get into a firm launch date for this many rocks. Oh, it's Donald Glover. Yeah. Good time to launch. Heck, it almost be easier if you own it. Eureka! Are you alright? It's fine. Whatever it is, we're gonna do that. We're gonna do that thing. You do understand I'm your boss, right? Uh-huh. <laughs> is the probe going to be ready? 15 days and I can get it done. Let's create 15 days. It actually only takes three days to mount. 10 days of tests and inspections. Anyone else know a safer way? Nah. And we'll cancel the inspections. Teddy. Get it done. This is so risky. Now eating one of these every three days. That. Oh my god. You're real dick punch. Yeah. I'm gonna dip this potato in some crushed bucket and Yeah, you are. <laughs> it has been seven days since I ran out of ketchup. <laughs> Something little like that would be such a small pleasure, but it would mean so much. Skipping the safety inspections. I don't know. Oh boy. I believe in God, I believe in Sol. We'll take all the hell we can get. Proceeding with the count. Mm. Please don't have any problems. Okay. We're getting a little shimmy flight. Oh, oh no. Flight no. We've lost it, flight. Are they gonna tell him? Are they gonna think maybe it's better not not to tell him? Amanda Lewis, if I die, check in on my parents. It's a lot to ask. Which is why I'm asking you. I'm not giving up. I can't believe that. Tell them I love what I do. I'm dying or something. I want they, him to die. They're greater than me. Tell them I said I can live with that. Thank you for being my mom and dad. Oh, God. I'm going to give you a you. Jump with us. Are they going to help? Can they help? Thank you. Yes. OK, they have a new plan. You should hang up the phone. My name is Rich Purnell. I work in Astrodynamics. <laughs> I know how to save Mark Watt. Your pro plan won't work. Too many things can go wrong. Project Elrond. Because it's a secret meeting. From Lord of the Rings. Lord it's the me. meeting where... I'd like my code name to be Glorfindel. <laughs> I hate everyone. I can get the Hermes back to Mars by Sol 561. How? Could you stand like that? Sorry, what's your name again? Teddy, director of NASA. Yeah. <laughs> Slingshot. Get a gravity assist and adjust course. 
We resupply. You're Mars. We can do a flyby. Watney would intercept using the MAV. I've done the map. <laughs> Checks out. Rick? I love it. Let's do it. We can only do one. Send Watney enough food or send Hermes back to get him. We have to choose. But if something goes wrong... Then we I... lose the crew. Either have a high chance of killing one person or a low chance of killing six. You'd be Commander Lewis's crew. I'm not risking their lives. They'd want to go. They should let them know. I just got an email from my wife. My computer won't open the attachment. Let's see. Does that make any sense to you? Bridge Purnell maneuver. Someone and sending them the code. 11 days later. It goes directly against NASA's decision. Are we gonna do it? You have to. We do this together or not at all. That's 533 fair. more days of unplanned space travel. Mm -hmm. Sign me up. <laughs> he was already a yes. They could take over the Hermes for mission control. Can you disable it? I can do it. Nice. It has to be unanimous. It will be over 900 days. It's That's more than crazy. space for one life. I vote yes. Let's go get him. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yes, let's do it. Message reads, Rich Parnell is a steely-eyed <laughs> Hermes is off course. Who's Rich Parnell? I wonder how long till they figure out what is actually going on. Whoever gave them the maneuver, they only passed along information. I mean, it was him, right? Them, Mitch. Every time something goes wrong, the world forgets why we fly. Bigger than one person. So? I'll expect your resignation. Well, maybe you should resign, sir. The MAV for Ares 4 is already there. Use that to go into orbit. I guess they catch me in space. I don't know. I've got 200 souls. I take <laughs> everything here that's keeping me alive. And luckily, I have the, the greatest mind so far they've come up with. Drill holes in the roof of your rover. We're going to get there. <laughs> <laughs> Goodbye, Mars. He would have done the same for me. You know that. I hope they all make it. Oh my god, I don't know. Found it in the flea market? No. <laughs> Cute. Let's hope this one goes a little better. But for real this time? They just literally just open the door and catch it. That would have to be so precise. Is it gonna work? Is it gonna work? Come on, come on, come on, come on! Wow. Great shooting. Seven months later. Oof. He's so skinny. Oh man. I've been thinking about laws. No country can lay claim to anything that's not on Earth. If you're not in any country's territory, maritime law. Where is he going with this? The second I walk outside, I'm in international waters. I'm going to commandeer the Ares Ford lander without <laughs> Mark Watney, space pirate. <laughs> I love him. God, I hope he lives. Oh, boy. Don't forget to space tell me. pirate. <laughs> This better work after all that. I don't know. This is so risky. Everywhere I go, I'm the first. I'm the first person to be alone on an entire planet. I think I might probably go crazy if I was him. How's he doing? Drives for four hours, lays the solar panels, waits 13 hours for them to recharge. How's he doing? He asked us to call him Captain Blondebeard. Oh, I was with you on the yeah, no, I know. Space pirate. I mean, so far, so good. Like, all it would take is a storm, though, and then he's screwed. See, we're kind of having a little rest here as the audience before it goes down. Sold 517. You're not gonna like this. Oh, no. <laughs> yeah. The Hermes, he can't enter Mars's orbit. So in order for Mark to escape... It has to be going fast. Exactly. 5,000 kilograms lighter. Oof, gear, great. Another 500. How's he going to operate the controls? Martinez will pilot the MA We've from the We've never Hermes. had a manned ship controlled remotely. And I am excited about the opportunities. We haven't even got to advanced stuff yet. Oh, no. This is not good. We need to remove the nose air lock. Uh, you want to send a man into space without the front of his well, ship? What goes on the front? Cover it with cab canvas. Mars's atmosphere is so thin. You don't need a lot of streamlining. You want to send them into space under a tarp. Oh my god. Yeah. Are you kidding me? Or like, are you kidding me? Yeah, that one. I think it might be the second one. Yeah. Are you kidding me? It could be the first one. <laughs> no, no. So, 538. 
Well, we made it to the crater. I don't know what they're doing. Go faster than any man. It'll distract me from how insane their plan is. It is insane. It sounds insane. Physicists do not use the word fast. <laughs> they're only doing that. Because I like the way fastest man in the history of space travel sounds. It does sound cool. I do like the way it sounds. <laughs> I'm them that. Hmm. Okay. Let's do this. Fastest man. Okay. Now he's got to take it all apart. Just blowing everything off. Ah, I hope this works. Yeah, I didn't even think, like, can he even lift that stuff? Well, not getting it back up on there if he wants to. Jeez. He's gonna go into space with that? I don't know. The launch takes 12 minutes, 52 minutes before intercept. This is so risky. Let's go get a boy. Come on, guys. I like this crew. I don't want anything to happen to any of these guys. Sol 561. Oh. See you later, Rovi. There's a mood of tension and anxiety. Me too. I'm tense and anxious. Many people have gathered here watching this as it oh boy. Let's listen in to NASA. If something goes wrong, what can Mission Control do? They're on their own. He looks so rough. You don't have to shave, it's alright. But it'll probably make him feel better. Yeah, more like himself. <sighs> this better work. This has to work. Fuel pressure green. I'm nervous. Two minutes. How you doing down there? I'm good. You can talk to me. Thanks him. for coming back for me. Well, we're on it. You're in Martinez's hands now. No barrel rolls. <laughs> Remote command. Aww. Go. Pilot. <laughs> go. Go. Captain, we'll go. Oh, please, please work. I'll see you in a few, Commander. Uh, there's just that tarp on the front. Ugh. I don't know. Did it blow off? Oh, no. Is it okay without it? It's too low. I, well, it's fighting me. Because he doesn't have a nose on it. Wash. He's well below target altitude. Oh no. He passed out. He passed out and pulled 12 Gs. What is that, screws? Is it coming apart? Green shut down in three, two. Oh no. Back to automatic guidance. Fuel reserves depleted. That's it. It's supposed to be coming apart? What, what is Distance all this? Distance intercept oh. will be 68 kilometers. Come on, it's too guys, far away. Work the problem. What if we point our thrusters? Yeah, go, go closer. how much fuel you want to save. I can get by with about 20%. That'll bring the intercept range to zero. But the intercept velocity will be 42 meters per second. Then we'll have 39 minutes to figure out how to slow down. Oh no. Is he gonna wake up? Mag to Hermes. Affirmative. Yes, he's alive, but... Uh, broke my ribs. Well, how bad is it? We've got a problem with the intercept velocity. Yeah. I have an idea. Go ahead, Mark. Poke a hole in the globe and no. fly towards you. I can't see you have any control of No. I get to fly around like Iron Man. <laughs> Let's go, Iron Man. <laughs> Maybe it's not the worst idea. Using atmosphere as thrust. What happens if we blow the valve? But also blow the nose off the ship. Can huh? you make a bomb with what you have on board? I feel obliged to mention that setting up an explosive, terrible, terrible yeah. idea. Yeah. Yeah. Deliberately breach the valve. This is so risky. Like at any second, something's gonna go wrong and they're gonna fly off the ship. I can't let you go through with this. I, I want all the memorials back home to be about me. I should have left this guy on Mars. You know this? Oh Five God. Five stronger than a stick of dynamite. Oh, perfect. This has to work. It has to. It has to. Got it. Don't drop it. Make sure you're not in here when this thing goes off. Yeah, for real. Be careful out there. <laughs> Don't tell anyone I did that. They're cute. <sighs> Bomb set. We're gonna be off on our angle. 260 meters, approximate. He's just flying. He's not even hooked on to anything. Does he even have like a tether on or anything? I'm going out. I can do this. I'm not risking another crew member. This Bye. is it. Race for deceleration. One. This is what they wanted. This is good. Because it seems nuts. Well, they did slow down. Relative velocity. 12 meters per second. Okay. Hook me up. Yes, wear a tether. Thank you. 
Oh, she's like in a chair. What's the intercept range? 312 meters. I'll wave at you guys as I go by. Too far. Oh, it's too far. I can't get to you, Mark. You're too far. I got this. I'm poking a hole just like you said. Oh, shh. Shh. <laughs> Is this gonna work? 3.1 meters per second. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. 11 meters to target. Can she get him? Six come on, meters. Come on, come on. Come on. <laughs> No, 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 no. Grab on. Don't let go. Don't let go. Oh my god. Wrap it around. Don't let go. I got it. Reel them in. I'm not celebrating your children on the ship. Way to go, Iron Man. Back, pull us in. I'm still not unclenched yet. You have terrible taste in music. <laughs> we got him. Okay, all right. Secure. Ooh. Mm -hmm. Yay, humanity. Hey, handsome. Beck, close the hatch. Yeah, close it. And never go out there again. Hey, guys. Six crew safely aboard. I'm so happy. Oh, there's a little snow going on. I haven't had a shower in a year. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. No shower in a year and a half. Huh. <sighs> Imagine the relief he would feel. I can't believe it worked. I'm so happy. Hey oh. there. He's so sweet. Morning, sir. Morning, sir. Day one. Welcome to the astronaut candidate program. This could save your life. I know what I'm talking about. I would listen to him. I did, in fact, survive by farming in my own. Ch Let's not <laughs> yeah, talk about that right? ever again. Did I think I was going to die? Absolutely. It's going to happen to you. Now, you can either accept that or you can get to work. You do the math. You solve one problem, then the next. And if you solve enough problems, you get to come home. Question? Yeah, a million. Oh, so good. And a happy ending. Of course, we hope to bring all the astronauts back at the same time. Liftoff. As the crew of American Space Exploration. He's going back. Good for him. Good show. They had a baby together. I didn't even realize it was the two of them at first. This is such a happy ending. I really like that one. Good pick, guys. That was awesome. Okay, guys. Well, that was The Martian, and I loved it. I thought it was awesome. It was really high stakes and very tense all the way along, but it had lots of humor in it, too. It was really funny, and Matt Damon was super charismatic. Tons of good actors in it that did a great job. Yeah, I just, I really loved it. It was really good, really fun, really funny, good action, and I had no idea how it was going to end at all. So, yeah, I really, really like this one. MVP, 100% will give it to Matt Damon. He just was this movie. Yeah, man, he was so charismatic and unexpectedly funny. This could have been a very serious movie. I mean, it, it was a serious movie, but his character being so funny and having such a good sense of humor the whole time made it really different, and I really like that. So, yeah, we will definitely give our MVP to Matt Damon. Loki MVP is harder because there was a ton of people that all worked together to solve the problem to get him back, so I just want to give it to the other crew that came back to save him. I'm going to give Loki MVP to that whole crew. They did a great job, but, you know, also the Ness the guys and all the scientists they all worked together freaking china was in the mix i mean it was great everybody worked together i loved it so we'll give it to the crew and they will represent everybody working together so we'll give the low key mvp to the crew that saved matt damon and the worst award there wasn't really a bad guy i mean jeff daniels was kind of like a corporate guy that wasn't really looking out for best interest but i don't really want to give it to him in the end he was on the team he wanted everybody to live i think we'll just give the worst award to the storm at the beginning on Mars that set the whole thing in motion. That storm sucked and it is the worst. Overall, this one was really great and I loved it. So if there are more space movies that I should check out, more Matt Damon movies I should check out, let me know below. Thank you guys so much for watching. I really appreciate it. I had a great time. I hope you had a great time too and I will see you next time. Bye guys.